Uh, we are both with regard to the issues uh, in, in the challenges of, of Chad itself, but also involved, uh, as we've been for a long time and continue to be, in efforts to find a political solution to the conflict in Darfur. You recall that we set up as one of the uh, main uh, causes for uh, deploying our force uh, that we wanted to address the uh, regional implications of the crisis in Darfur. But we recognize, of course, that there are problems in Sudan, problems in Chad, and regional problems, and we need to have an, a, a comprehensive approach to those things. UFR has been the largest and most multinational European Union military operation in Africa. Once UFR's deployment was achieved, the feedback from the ground became progressively more positive. As a result, UFR gained a purchase on peace, by which it, mean it gained an initiative towards positive development and in so doing began to meet the expectation for, to those, for those for whom it was designed. We will continue our programs of rehabilitation, of relaunching development in the area um, under both funding, which we still have uh, from the 9th EDF, but also funding from the 10th EDF. Um, that means we will continue to finance uh, the police training. We will continue to finance Minurkat um, uh, <clears throat> in order to, um, uh, to make sure that the, the Chadian police uh, is, in, is in a position to, um, to guarantee security. We will continue with the humanitarian element uh, of the operation and we will step up now the efforts in terms of um, uh, reintegration, rehabilitation. Common cost, the budget for me for the period of 14 months was initially set at 119 million and agreed at 119 million. I can tell you that um, probably unique in the economic world over the last 14 months, we came in distinctly under budget. And I don't know if there were too many other organizations around the world in the year, fiscal year 2008 came in under budget. We did. The mere fact that we were in Eastern Chad at this moment in time has probably also led to a uh, reduced uh, activity among some of the groups that uh, we have known traditionally have been passing on and off uh, the, the, the frontier. But, but the mission's aim was never to, to, to solve the, the internal problems in Darfur. It was to address the regional consequences of a serious situation, a conflict situation in Darfur, which has so far led to 250,000 refugees in, in, in uh, in camps in, in eastern Chad, which of course is a, is a very significant burden and a, and a great human tragedy, of course. And uh, what we see now of, uh, in, in terms of the um, consequences of, uh, of, of expulsions in, in Darfur might well eventually, of course, create further instability also affecting Chad.